What's up, guys? It's your boy, Nick, with Hercules Fit. And today, I want to talk about how many reps, sets, and days should you work each muscle group. I thought this would be a good-ass topic because there's a lot of people that have no idea what the fuck they're talking about. And you guys know me. I like to be the beacon of truth. I like to tell you guys how it is. Straight, no chaser. So you're going to learn today how many to do. When I first started lifting the weights, and I know I, I always go back to me when I first started because I can only use my own personal experience. I can't use nobody else's experience. When I first started working out, I had no idea how many sets to do, what kind of reps to do, and how many days to work out. I kind of just went to the gym and just did whatever like a lot of people do. I can tell you from personal experience, do not do that. Get your ass a program, follow a program, whether it's mine or somebody else's, and actually stick to it. You'll get the best results with that. But when it comes to what you should do, I will start off with how many days a week you should be going to the gym. Now, this is going to depend on um, how many days you are able to go to the gym, and it's also going to depend on what you can handle at that time, so your skill set, your skill level. The more skilled you are, obviously, the more days a week you can go to the gym. The less skilled you are, the less days a week that you can lift weights. So, assuming you are an absolute beginner, I would say the bare minimum should be three days a week. Now, if you ask other people, they may not say that. They may say, oh, you need to go five, six days a week. But I can tell you from personal experience, you can go to the gym one time or work each muscle group one time per week. Now that brings me into, I've already done a video on, you know, the best bodybuilding split and stuff like that, in my opinion. So I'm not going to get into that, but depending upon what your split is, you should be able to, in three days, work your entire body if you are a beginner. So three days, you should be able to work your entire body if you are a beginner and you are doing a certain split, like a push-pull legs or a three-day split, however you want to break it up. If you, as you get more advanced, I would say add a day at a time. So, for example, when I first started working out, I just did three days a week push-pull legs. Um, this was after I learned how to properly work out. Uh, push-pull legs. I worked everything just one time per week. Did great. Built, built plenty of muscle doing Did it for like a whole year. Built plenty of muscle doing that. So I can vouch for you that people that say you can't build any muscle working shit once per week, you're full of shit. If you are doing enough volume, enough sets, enough reps, which I'm about to get into, you can work each muscle group one time per week, especially if you are new to working out and you know you don't have time to go to the gym more or you just don't have the physical or psychological capabilities to work out five, six days a week. So that leads me into the amount of reps and sets that you should be doing. I would say the bare minimum amount of reps you should be doing if you're trying to build muscle should be eight reps. Now, some people will say six, some people will say five. Yes, you can build muscle with five and six reps. They've done studies and found that you can, but just because you can do it doesn't mean you should do it. Here's why. When you start going uh, below eight reps, you start getting like four and five and six reps. Yes, you can build some muscle with that, but one, you're not spending enough time under tension underneath the bar. So I can tell you from practical experience, you're not going to build as much muscle with that as you will when you start going a little bit higher, like around the 8 to 12 range. The second reason is the lower the reps you do, the higher chance of injuring yourself because you have to lift much heavier fucking weight as you're doing those low ass reps, assuming that you're training to failure, which you should be. So you're better off just doing eight reps at the minimum, 8 to 12. Now, you can go a little bit above 12. You can go up to 15. I know some bodybuilders, they do 20, 25 fucking reps. You can do all that, but I would personally say stick to the 8 to 12 range because, one, who the fuck wants to do more reps than what they have to? I can tell you from practical experience and just from studies that they've done, 8 to 12 is fine for most people. Now, yes, you have some people that will respond better with 15 to 20 fucking reps. And you have some people like your Ronnie Coleman and Jay Cullors, they can do 6 to 8 reps and get just as good of results because the genetics are just that fucking good. But I would say for most people, including myself, stick to the 8 to 12 range. That's good enough. Now, when it comes to the amount of sets that you should do, this is, this is fun. They found out that if you are a beginner, when I say they, I'm talking about studies when I was, you know, getting my degree and shit like this, but from practical experience too, about three set or about nine sets or three different exercises per muscle group is the most optimal for muscle growth. Now that does not mean that you have 
to do that many sets per muscle. You can get away with five or six sets per muscle group, particularly if you are a beginner. But it means that to be the most optimal for muscle for muscle growth, I would say at least three sets, three different exercises at different angles per muscle group. So if you're doing your biceps, you're gonna to wanna to do at least three exercises and do three different angles for those exercises to build the most muscle. That's gonna give you the most bang for your buck. Now, obviously, as you get more advanced, you can do 12 sets, 15 sets, hell, shit. Sometimes I'll do 20 sets for a muscle group depending upon how I feel that day. So you can definitely do more as you get more advanced, but as you are a beginner, I would start off with at least three sets, three different exercises um, per exercise for three different exercises per muscle group. Um, that's pretty much what you want to do. So I pretty much went over the went over the basics. I'm not gonna make this a long video, but you know you can work each muscle group one time per week if you are hitting enough volume in that in that routine. Don't let anybody tell you that you have to work each muscle group twice a day. You don't have to work each muscle group twice a week to build muscle. For the longest time, hell, including now, sometimes I work shit once a week. Now you may be like, well, you're advanced, you can do that. Even when I was a beginner, I would work for a long time. I would work my uh, each muscle group one time per week. I did a push pull legs. I double up maybe on you know uh, a different muscle group each week. So at one point I started going to the gym four days a week, and I would just double up on a different muscle group each week. So one week I double up on my chest, shoulders, and triceps. Next week I double up on my back and biceps. And I always would pretty much keep legs at about one time per week because that's really all I could withstand at that time. But yes, you can work each muscle group one time per week as long as you are doing, I would say, at least three different sets per uh, exercise and at least three different um, exercises. So as long as you're doing at least, I would say, nine sets, you can work each muscle group one time per week and still build a fuck ton of muscle. I know from my personal experience, and I've literally trained people like that, and I've got them to build muscle like that. So it, you can do it. And obviously, if you're advanced, you can, you know, work out twice a week, uh, each muscle group or once a week, kind of do whatever you want if you're advanced. But as a beginner, yes, you can just work the muscle group one time per week, as long as you are doing at least, I would say, nine sets, three different exercises before that muscle group. So guys, I hope this answers somebody's motherfucking question. You know, I'm giving you guys the game. If you watch my videos, you will get swole. There's a direct correlation between watching my shit and getting swole as fuck. So, Appreciate you guys. Love you guys. Check out my programs. Link in the description. You will get jacked. You will get shredded. And uh, it's your boy Nick, your boy Hercules, signing out.